Hey guys, Ninja Punch here playing Pikmin 4, continuing on our adventure with the Night Expeditions. We have three Leaflings left. We're going to try and keep going with that before we go to the main uh, main adventure areas. So let's continue on with the Night Expeditions. Super excited. Continue on. Last one we were in uh, the uh, Sun Speckled Terrace. Uh, I wonder if we're going to stay there or if we're going to go to Blossoming Arcadia. I'm not sure yet. I don't know how many areas are in each one. I guess, well, I guess it says three. Okay, so question answered. <laughs> so, uh, so these ones were good. So we got to go to the here. Check the danger level before you begin. That way you'll know if it's safe to start to expedite. Okay, so I'm good. <clears throat> Sun Speckled Terrace, Mendering Slope. Two flames. Shouldn't be too bad. Let's get right into the adventure again, guys. Thank you all who have subscribed and shown support on this series and given the thumbs up button. And if you haven't, please do if you like the channel and you want to continue with us. And if you like the video, of course, do smash that thumbs up button. But anyway, let's go ahead and get right into it. Eight glow seeds. Uh, I actually... So I used them last episode. So I wonder if I don't use them, then they kind of... Then they kind of... Like, the quantity goes up. I'm not sure about that. So I'm going to try not to use them this episode. And then if we get more, and then it goes up to like 16 or whatever, then it will kind of find that answer as well. But I'm super excited. I want to try and find... All the different things. We got a lot of stuff here. Uh, there's my glow Pikmin. I love these guys. They're so cool. Uh, come in. Can you hear me, Ninja Punch? A while back, I taught Ochi a particular skill used for operations that involve protecting a client. Huh? It's a security dog. Select the luminol you want Ochi to protect and give him the command. Oh, that's interesting. Uh, Ochi will patrol near the luminol. And bite any creatures that come close during a night expedition. If he gets separated from your squad, he'll go to the spot and patrol it for you. Uh, work with him to protect the luminol. Interesting. I'm actually going to use that, I think. Hopefully, Ochi doesn't die. That'd be real sad, actually. Uh, how do I do that, actually? Let's see. Uh, command. Yeah, protect it. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, wait. Where's my... There we go. Okay, that kind of screwed me up a little bit. Hopefully, I can I can move a little bit faster here. Oh man! All right, let's let's activate this guy there. All right, so the creature's starting to perk up. That's fine though. I want to get all these guys here. Now, are these enemies right here? I'm not sure. And apparently I can go in the mound. That's new. Uh, is it just gonna give me material? I think it just gave me... I think it just gave me material. Uh, I think. Alright, track creatures using your night radar. Alright, so... Got a bunch of them coming over here. We'll be able to get these guys. These guys are going to be easy. Easy day. Ochi's still protecting uh, the area for us. So we're good there. Yeah, I see him right there. He's good. I'm just going to run around and try to kill all the creatures before they even start coming our way. I feel like that might be a good thing. What's that? Should I destroy these mounds? I saw, I saw material come out of them, though. I don't know if that does anything, but we got a big guy coming in here. Yeah, he's coming this way. Let's head back, get all of our peeps first. Uh, I'm not seeing too many uh, crazy peeps. And we pretty much got all the loom. Uh, we got mostly everything. There's a few little things here and there. Get him! <laughs> All right, easy day, easy day. Get those. All right, this these guys are coming pretty quick. Oh, but so are these guys. Uh, where are they coming from? They're coming from all over here. I I kind of want to see how this works. Okay, he's oh, okay. So he's doing pretty good damage actually. Uh, more so than actually than I thought. We got into a tussle. Let's keep going. I kind of want to collect all these. All 
All right, that's a big guy. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna take this guy on here. There we go. Nailed it. Doing some good damage here. Work all this in. Ochi's pretty much killing it right now over there. I really don't even have to worry about him. He's kind of just doing good work. I'm not going to lie. Oh, so the mounds actually spit these guys out. So it's in our best... So I guess it's in our best interest to kind of destroy those mounds. Ochi's still just killing it over here. I think they killed the... No, they actually didn't even get that mound either. Let's go ahead and destroy all these guys. I wonder if that's going to be all of the... Uh... No, it's not all of them. But we got pretty darn... I mean, we got all the... I don't know if we got the, uh... All creatures destroyed one. Well done, new blood. You managed to protect the luminol. So, I wonder if we have to take all those mounds out to get all creatures destroyed. Uh, Ninja Punch Ochi, you did it. Yes, we did. There it is. Aha, uh -huh, look at the color on that. I can't wait to make medicine with it. Sounds about right. All right, up we go. So that's pretty interesting. I think from now on, we're just going to go ahead and just try and... I guess we'll just try and get all the mounds taken care of. And then we only have to really worry about whatever creatures are on the map itself, like, at the start. So that actually will probably be a lot better. Because if I take all those mounds out, I really don't have to worry about anything. Like, nothing new, at least, coming on. So that would be pretty cool. I think that's what we're going to do. And as always, every single episode, these loading screens are so long. Oh my god. I, w I really wish, like, there was, like, a smoother transition from, like, scene to scene. Or, like, whatever the case may be. Whatever you want to call it. I really do. Like, they are so long. But we are back. Hello, friends. Did you miss us? I am exhausted. Been up all night. Uh, creatures defeated. Five out of six. So, that's cool, though. That's fine. I'm not too worried about it. Awaiting cure. Another leafling. Another pup drive, too. Okay, so I didn't use any, and now I got 14 collected. So I'm probably just not going to use the glow seeds unless I really have to. Unless I, like, I fail a night expedition. Uh, my observations have me do an important realization. Glow Pikmin cannot die. What? How? What do you mean? Well, when a glow Pikmin uh, meets its demise, it turns into photons and returns to luminol or something like as it seems. Are they really Pikmin, then? That's kind of weird. I did not know that. That is pretty cool. This is now my newest favorite Pikmin. <laughs> Rescue mission day 14. Alright, so that one was pretty easy. Let's see what this guy has right. Administer the cure at once. Yes, Captain. Alright, let's see what we got. Who's that? I don't know who that is. I don't think that's Bernard. He doesn't look like Bernard. He looks like a djinn. <laughs> uh, he's always in search of the next uncharted planet to explore, as well as someone who wants to hear tales of his past adventures. He's a space explorer. That is djinn. Our work doesn't end here. It's our duty to care for and protect anyone who we've rescued and hear what they have to say. Okay, so, uh, new guy. He has a stopwatch. Uh... Alright, you are the one who saved me. Thank you. I will never forget your kindness. My name is Jin. I'm an adventurer wandering the universe in search of uncharted lands. Adventurers never skip their training. You can do most as long as you can rely on your physical self. Which brings me to another important aspect of Dandori Challenge Training Meditation. Why don't we give it a try? Uh, sure. If you can visualize your Dandori well, I will present you with a small reward. I see you are able to visualize it well. You already have uh, remarkable potential. Alright, so I got 30 for... Okay, I got another for three challenges. Uh, please take that. Continue to work hard and keep up with your training. Okay, so I got to do six more. To, or get six more gold. Which... 
I'm pretty sure all of these are gold, and this one's platinum. I'm pretty sure, because I didn't get this one, and I didn't get this one done. But I did get this one, so platinum's the best. So these ones have to be gold, so we should be pretty good. I didn't get platinum in those. Maybe I might come back to that and, and finish those a little later. I don't know if I'm going to do that right now. I also want to upgrade real quick. I want to see what I can do with Ochi. See if we can train him up a little bit more. Uh, so that's all. Uh, learn doggy powder. Learn pluck. Uh, I, so I did learn pluck. I feel like this one's pretty important during the night expiration uh, expeditions. So we'll do that one. Uh, we'll do chomp too. Because that one's going to be really important as well. I have two left. I can get him to level three. There you go. Now he should be... Who Master Chomp? Was it you? Yes, it was, Ochi. It was you, good boy. Now you should be ready to learn an even more powerful skill, Big Chomp. Okay. Because that's like buff and then super buff. So, yeah. But that takes three pup drives. So that's pretty rough to do. And there's three levels of it. So we'll probably have to figure that out later. I don't know. But alright guys, like I said, these ones are going to be short episodes before we get back to the long episodes. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please do make sure you subscribe and smash that thumbs up button if you have not already. But as always, thanks for watching. Until the next one, goodbye. <laughs>